Hey, hey, welcome back. Okay, I am now in the kitchen and we are gonna do that right now. This is the lemon cucumber. Now, I have never had this before, so I think this would be pretty interesting. So what we'll do is, uh, we'll just put it right there. Let's see if I can zoom out just a little bit. Hopefully we can get a good shot. I'm going to cut this right in half so you can see what the texture looks like. And this is what the cucumber looks like. Okay, so we got this one here. And the lighting in the kitchen is not that great, folks. Sorry about that. But I didn't want to cut it outside. Okay, now what I'm going to do is uh, get a little slice over here and uh, check it out. See how it tastes. Let you guys know what it tastes like. Just a slight taste of lemon. Um, tastes very much like a green cucumber. So let's cut a slice and take a look at it. Okay, so that's what it looks like. And uh, by the way, it tastes very good. Mm hmm. All right. Okay. So that'll be good for my dinner tonight. And. Let's take a little slice of this tomato. See what we look like on the inside. And that's what it looks like on the inside. Oh my goodness. I guess I have to take a taste test on this one too. All right, Sleek, this is for you, man. I know you're the one that requested the uh, me to cut this uh, lemon cucumber. But right now, I'm going to get a little taste test of this juicy, juicy tomato. Oh my goodness. Wow. That is delicious. Yeah. Mmm. So anyway, folks, thank you guys for joining me. This is a little evening harvest going on just for the uh, dinner. So what I'm going to do is just kind of slice up these tomatoes and uh, my dinner will be ready in a minute. Just put this on top of my plate. So I'll have one tomato tonight and I'll have, um, and I'll have a few cucumbers and I think I'll dress it up with a little seasoning. I will put um, a little sea salt. I have some Hawaiian salt that I normally use all the time. I just love Hawaiian salt or sea salt. I don't care for the iodized salt. Too high in sodium and it's not as healthy. So let me see. Yeah, I think I'm going to have two cucumbers tonight. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm almost finished with my dish over here tonight. So, man, you guys are joining Mr. Paco for dinner. Okay, so here we go. We got the yellow uh, cucumber. We got the tomato going. Let me move this board over here. Put the final touches on it. And we in Hawaii, we have a lot of sticky rice. So I'm gonna finish this plate off. Let's go ahead and move this away. I'll zoom it out. So I can show you guys what the dish looks like and I think I'll be sending this to Betty's kitchen. Well Betty, this is a local dish. It's just uh, it's just a steak and then I have some uh, sticky rice I'm putting on right now. And that is normally always accompanied by a little soy sauce. So we'll be putting that on in a second. Okay, and I just use the old Kikuman soy sauce. And that normally just goes over the rice a little bit, all over the steak a little bit. Okay, now I season the steak with just some black pepper and seasoned salt. I use any type of seasoned salt, but this is a rock salt. It's a red salt. And I just put that on top of my vegetables. A couple turns. And then I just use this uh, McCormick black pepper. Put that on my veggies. And that is it. 
And Mr. Parker is going to sit down now. And uh, let me take the camera off this tripod. Get a real good look. Oh, come on, buddy boy. Don't make such big noises, all right? I know. Okay, so this is what we got here. We got the local boy sticky rice. We got the T-bone steak going on. I got that medium well. Then I got the lemon cucumber right from the garden a minute ago and the tomato from the garden just a minute ago. Please enjoy you guys evening. I know I will. Mr. Paco signing off. Peace. See ya.